My name is Evelyn Namara and I'm a confident leader. Confidence is a combination of two things, preparation and self-awareness as well as your personal abilities. If you're prepared for whatever you're going to do, be it a job interview or meeting people for a talk, it's all about the confidence and preparation that you put in. Confidence is a very good characteristic of good leadership, especially in terms of inspiring other people that you're working with, because they need to have someone they can look up to. You're inspiring values that they do not know they actually have. So when they see someone going before them and absolutely doing it, then they become confident in their own skin. I'm a technologist and I did computer science and I learned very early in my career that being confident was going to be key to my success. We meet a lot of people in, in, in this industry and you're faced with a lot of stereotypes wherever you go to do your work and it takes you standing up for yourself and knowing that you're prepared for whatever it is and showing that you can actually do the job. Uh, first of all is people not believing in you, especially in a male-dominated field. So early on I faced a lot of stereotypes as a young techie, you know, you're just upcoming, excited about the industry. And then we had this, you know, very conservative system administrator men who would look at me and say, we don't think you can actually do the work that you're supposed to do. The greatest compliment I've received as a leader is being called a fearless influencer of society. All the values I live for and everything I work for, I always want to be in a position where I can inspire young girls, I can inspire young women coming up to be fearless and, and face their day's uh, challenges. So for me, that's the biggest compliment I've ever received. We need to step up. The world needs more of us right now. We are in a world where female leaders are being so inspirational, the ones that are on top, and we need more uprising leaders to fill that gap. Because when you have a leadership that is balanced, we need to be equals. You know, we can't solve the problems when half of the other population is not inspired. I equate Fast Fast to creating opportunities for women. You know, if you're already up and you have the opportunity to be somewhere, it's good to make way for other women to rise up and be the very best they can.